talking about your back, you know, and, and just getting back into shit, you know, yeah. making the decision to do that. Yeah, you know, I, I, I just really decided, you know, because of the pain and, and just really not being happy with my appearance, I, I decided I was going to get back into it. But, you know, the hardest thing is working out by yourself. I mean, it's like, come on. Yeah. You know, and I've always worked out with, you know, a partner. And now with my schedule, going to the gym, you know, it's just, I needed, I needed some help. Yeah. And so, I mean, you guys were perfect, you yeah. know. And, you know, having Eric show up every day or every three times a week on time and for an hour and, and really knowing what to do. I mean, that for me was huge. I mean, I, I didn't need a trainer just to come in and say, hey, you know, push this and pull that and do whatever. I mean, the schedule, the uh, workouts, the way they were designed, uh, push and pull exercises that were matched perfectly, um, the weight increase that was gradual, uh, the body composition started to change, the strength started to go up. I mean, it was everything just was in sync. Yeah. And so even after the first month, I kind of knew that I was, you know, where I needed to be. And, um, you know, it just started going in the right direction all the way through. Yeah. So I was real happy with that altogether. Now, were you a little concerned or I, I wouldn't say, I was going to say skeptical, but more concerned going into this, you know, because of the, the problems you was having with your back? And I mean, it's, it, it's always kind of just like, when's it going to jump out and grab you? And... Um, Anytime I got into a back exercise, I was I was nervous, uh, but uh, you know we we just really went into it just real gradual to kind of see, you know where our limits, you know where my limit was on that. Absolutely. And was able to not really push the limit, but kind of know hey here's my comfort zone, and it, what I liked about it is that comfort zone just continued to grow and grow and you know like in any rehabilitation you start to build the muscle up around even the injured area yep. and you just get better and, and stronger and I mean it's just a, a world of difference you know now than when I started back in January absolutely and and talking about that you know what uh, what type of results since January have you seen you know with uh, with the program that we've implemented I mean uh, one thing that really surprised me was uh, outside of my back uh, coming along the way that it has but what's my strength I mean, it, it just, it was just, it's been a steady climb. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I was even surprised that, you know, Eric would design my next week program, he'd come in and it would be, you know, five pounds heavier or 10 pounds heavier or depending on the exercise, two and a half pounds heavier, but it was an increase. Yeah. And, you know, it kind of seemed like the week before was, was pretty tough, but I managed it. And, and was right on track. It was almost like Eric really kind of knew, here's where it needs to be just to go to that next limit. And very rarely did I not meet it by a rep or two reps. It was like right on the money. So I, I was probably more surprised than anybody to see that. Absolutely. And, 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 and actually having worked out and been through it, um, I was still surprised. Absolutely. And did you feel like, you know, the track in part that we implement, really seeing that progress, you know, that was that was helpful information for oh, you. Oh, you know, I, I think one of the things I, I really love uh, about the system and, and the way you guys put things together is that I don't have to worry about what I'm going to work out. Uh, I mean, I don't have to. I mean, like I get up, I'm like, okay, all right, what's what are we doing today? And, yep. and I don't have to. How many reps? What's the weight? I mean, and you know. He doesn't have to, but he slaps the weights on for me. He's taking them off for me. I mean, he's telling me how many reps. He's writing it down. He knows exactly what we did the week before, exactly what we're going to do. I mean, everything's there. And I can't tell you how important it is to have that. You know, if you go to the gym and you work out by yourself, number one, if you're not keeping track of what you're doing, uh, I don't care. You're yeah. not going to get the progress that you're looking for. Absolutely. And if you do keep track of it, that right there is going to cut your workout time in half. Yep. So that in itself, I think, is worth the money yep. completely because your time is money. Yep. And the results, I mean, you know, let's face it. If you go to the gym and you don't get the results, it's all a big waste anyway. Yep. So I'm really pleased with the way things have gone. That's great. So strength's definitely improved. Back's better, uh, you know, and obviously body composition shift. 
you know, clothes are fitting a little bit better. Yeah, you know, it's really weird because I noticed, you know, okay, my strength's going up, uh, but my T-shirts started fitting, you know, a lot tighter in my, my chest and my arms, and I was like, okay, this looks pretty good, you know? And uh, then when my, my wife starts making comments, you know, then, then that, that made me feel really good. Yeah. And, and then, you know, my jeans, you know, and, and, you know, my legs, you know, my thighs, they were getting too tight. Yeah. And then, and then the waist, they were getting a little, <laughs> they were getting a little baggy. Yeah. And I was like, hey, this is cool. Okay. And then, okay. Yeah. Um, you know, kind of going back to the X yeah. You know, yeah. That's figure, awesome. you know, so I don't know. It was good, you know. That's great. Right. So. so so you feel like you're starting to really get that momentum back, you know, since you, you like you talked about, you've been out for a few years, but starting to get that momentum back. Yeah, totally. I mean, I kind of really feel like, you know, now I'm kind of at a, at a, at a spot in this whole program that I can really feel like I, I'm about to go to the next level. Yep. I mean, I, I, you know, since I started in January, here it is in September, I've gone probably, I would say, through at least two different levels. And, you know, you kind of just take it to another level. And, you know, it's nice to, to not get stuck doing the same workout routine. Absolutely. And so when you go to a new level, you switch up the routine. You kind of confuse your muscles. You wake things up. But, you know, and, and it's great because what I really was surprised overall was the way Eric put the exercises together that, you know, you, you, you can do a lot of back exercises and one particular exercise that you're focusing on, and then you're like, okay, I, we've worked on this for two or three weeks, and we go to another exercise that's brand new, and I'm surprisingly strong at it to start out with, and it's one I haven't done. Yep. And so we'll work on that exercise, and then I'll kind of go to maybe even back or mix them, and it's weird how they interlock. And I mean, you're, so you're stepping up, in an unusual pace, yep. and, the, and the workout and exercises never get stale. Yep. So it's good. Yeah, yep. I like that. That's great. That's great. Yeah. So really, really bringing out more muscle groups and really bringing them together more efficiently has helped out a lot. Yeah, I mean, you know, you're not just, you know, you're not just doing the traditional, you know, chest and buys. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. There's always a mix in there, and you know, and you know, I don't like doing legs one day. Yeah. Okay, I just I don't like it. Yeah. But it's nice to be able to do you know, you know some quads or some buttocks, you know, uh, hams maybe, and also get in you know some back. Yep. In the same day. Yep. So you kind of really are mixing it up. So yep. it's good. And you're training your body like you are moving around every day, so it's a lot more functional. Absolutely. That's great. That's yeah. Great. I mean, and, and really, you know, I, I've. Honestly, I have to tell you, there for a while, I was really tired after the workouts, like, you know, by lunch. I was just like, oh, man, I'm so tired. But that only lasted for about a month, yep. about six weeks. And once I got into my, my routine, it really picked up. I started feeling more energetic, yep. feeling a lot better. My appetite started going up. I started, I'm, I'm just, you know, it, it's hard to put, you know, the proper emphasis on, having a routine and then keeping track of your progress. It Absolutely. Really is. Just that support structure, accountability to the right right habits. Yeah, you know? absolutely. Yeah, great. Now, uh, so you feel life now is definitely much better than where it was before. Yeah, I mean, you know, really, I haven't had, knock on wood, any issues with my back. I'm feeling a lot stronger. Um, I'm a lot more confident about taking my shirt off, like, you know, we formed a fishing trip and, you know, all the guys taking their shirts off and most of them were kind of fat and overweight. Yeah. And, and that was kind of embarrassing for them. <laughs> I was embarrassed for them, <laughs> you know, being 10 to 15 years older than them. And, I, you know, I took my shirt off and I felt really good about it. And I was like, okay, wow, you know, yeah. you know. Yeah. And then when we came back and we're showing everybody the pictures, I wasn't worried about it. I was like, you know, hey, yeah. I've been working out, you know, for, you know, nine months. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and, and, and they didn't want to show their pictures. Yeah, you can, hang, you can hang that up on the wall there. Yeah, yeah, so that's good. <laughs> that's awesome. Now, what would you, uh, what would you say to someone that may be on the fence about, you know, uh, get help, you know, professional help with their fitness uh, to help them achieve their goals? You know, I'd say that, you know, especially if you're in your 40s, it's mandatory. I mean, if, if you really want to make your health a priority and not waste time, 
you got to do it. it. It's just, you got to do it. Yeah. I mean, okay, you know, very few people out there, uh, even in their 40s, can say, I'm going to start working out and do what they need to do the way they need to do it and make that kind of progress and keep track of it on their own. There's very few people out there that can do that. And, and you know, and, and I've done it before, and I'll tell you, it's still even hard. And, it, and actually having a trainer and a structured program, you know what, it's a luxury, okay? Even those of us that probably could do it, it's still a luxury. It's nice to have that trainer there, so. Absolutely. You know. That's great. Well, you, uh, you know, the big thing with you is, you know, you've had, you know, a lot of success in the past, but uh, you, you understand the value in, in having that support, and uh, you're, you're obviously responded to it really well. And, yeah. uh, and we look forward to continue working with you and also, uh, you know, continue the, the progress going forward. Absolutely. All right. Thank you so much.